Hello guys and welcome to my 2B2T exploration video. In today's video we're just going to be continuing exploring this island and seeing what, what it has to offer. Like in the last video we found uh, like a player's corpse and pretty much got all our stuff. Even though they didn't have that much, it was still better than nothing. And I did get an upgrade in armour so I can't complain. I'm very happy that I got an upgrade in armour, even though it's called HBT Logan's Leggings. What the hell? I'm gonna need to mine coal and kill it like every cow I see so I can get XP to fix them. Like, the fact that the armour was damaged it means uh, either they hadn't repaired it or they were in a battle and their health was really low. They must have tried to frantically put the thing in their e chest, but they died before they could get everything in. I think that's what happened. Like they were trying to get their stuff in the e chest frantically, and uh, that means someone could have killed them and uh, basically left the other stuff there. I'm thinking, or someone just died on accident. That could have happened too. But you've got to look at things in a certain way, just in case. There's more cows here, I need the XP. Oh, don't you run. I hate it when they do that. Too fast. Oh yeah, that is definitely fixing. Good, good, good. I used to think mending was like, only if you were like, save, like you were mining. Well, like say if you had it on a pickaxe, it was only if you were mining. I didn't think it was XP that made it mending. So like, I thought if you like mending on armor would be so overpowered because I thought it would be like, basically if you got hit it would fix. But I was wrong. That would be really overpowered. I would imagine someone hits you when you've got armor on, it just fixes itself. I really should have saved those enchanting bottles because if I can get mending in my whole armor, I'm pretty much a god. I have enchanting bottles, like it's just it's just like I'm in a fight and uh, someone's about to like destroy my armor and just throw an enchanting bottle on the ground or a few of them. It's just like yep. Oh good. Let me get these this coal so I can get the XP. It should be close to like pretty much full by now. Yeah 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 it is. All I need to do is get mending on the rest of my armor and I'm good to go. I also need to get on breaking on my helmet because my helmet's already nearly broke. Well, not nearly broken, but it's already decently damaged again. And I just recently fixed it. It's bloody annoying. I hate my helmet. It needs to be fixed. With the XP. Wait, is my XP still not going up? Come on now, game. I need it to go up. Oh well, at least my leggings are now fixed. Or that other person's leggings, I wouldn't say mine. mine. I just happened to find them. Oh yeah, see if you are the guy that I took the leggings from and you, you like see my video. S say hi in the comments please. Be pretty nice. Like, I'd like to know if you were, like, recently there, or that was something from ages ago. Because it'd be pretty cool. Like, if it was something from recent, that'd be even cooler, because that means that there's definitely player activity in the area. And I need to be mm. careful. They definitely didn't have a base on the island because I've not seen a single sign of a base. They did destroy a, a village on the island, however. I'm wondering what killed the guy. Maybe it was hunger because I didn't. S no, wait. I know that he had god apples, but like. If you're gonna die of hunger, you might as well eat the god apples. 
wonder, it must have been hunger. He must have just not wanted to eat the god apples. Because he had no food on him. Oh wait, no, he, I think he did actually. I will find out what, what killed him. I really want to. Hmm. I don't think it was mobs, because there was no mobs nearby. It must have either been a player, hunger, or uh, they killed, or he self-killed himself. Maybe he made a mistake and accidentally typed slash kill. That would have been funny. It's so much nether rack though. Hmm. It's a pretty nice island to explore, I have to say. Is that a wee forest? Oh nice. Some sheep. Nice wee mountain we're climbing. Oh, what is this? Is this just a little... Oh, wow. Now that's some world generation right there. Tons of gravel just sitting here and... What is this? Alright, let's get a screenshot. Wait, there's a mob up there. Is that just floating? It is. God damn. Oh yeah, the Escape from Tarkov uh, video was a complete disaster and I'm not going to be playing that game because, uh, yeah, it's not. it kind of messed up when we were recording it and uh, I can't be bothered fixing it. So yeah, no Escape from Tarkov, sadly. Plus, we kept getting killed as soon as we spawned in. So it was kind of pointless. Plus, my game wasn't loading very well. Ah, yes. Random flat sided mountain. I'm not going down there. Alright. Right. All <gasps> oh, right. I'm never doing that again. That was scary. I nearly died. I like using this axe now. Like this axe is just so cool. I love it. I did not think axes were this powerful. <laughs> I wonder what other enchantments I can put on it. I'll need to look it up after this. Just make this axe absolutely overpowered. I want this coal. What 
You want my boots that way? How am I? Oh yeah, I did repair my boots recently. I need to get Ferrer fallen ASAP and get rid of fire protection. Getting rid of fire protection because it's useless. Oh, there's a mob. It's a zombie. I like zombies. <laughs> Two hits. Oh, my XP's finally going up again. Nice. I don't know if I'll make another 2B2T video tonight. I might make a fourth one, I don't know. Depends on how I feel. Let's make a wee bridge here. Just for people. I'll do something nice. Making a lovely wee bridge. Out of nether rack. Good wee bridge. I really want to make a base, but I'm gonna wait till I find that biome. Or if I find a snowy biome, like a full snow biome, like the flatlands, not flatlands, but flat snowy biome, because I really need to farm strays for those slowness arrows, because I'll need them for PvP at some point. Or I could use Arrows of Leaping, because in Fitz's video he did say Arrows of Leaping are really good for PvP, but I want Slowness Arrows, because they seem like they would do better against someone's hacks. But I could be wrong. Wait, yeah, I'm going this way. Boom. Die, pig. Give me the XP. I want this XP. Let's go to the left again and see if the island continues. Because it usually does. Oh, there's a mob. I want to kill it. Use my axe. Axe! There we go. Level 19. Oh yes. See what's on this wee island over here. Yeah, look, see, it does continue a bit more. Come on, I want this coal. Oh. No, uh, I don't... No, wait, I'm going to keep the golden apples. I was going to say I don't need them anymore, but I might actually need them. They can be for like if I'm in a like pickle and I need to heal quickly. That creeper just stood there and took it. All right. <laughs> no matter uh, inventory. Do I'm gonna store this gunpowder because I might need it soon. Who's online? Uh, no one I really know. Oh god, careful. Some chests down there. I might go for them, I don't know. Should I? Uh, they're a bit deep, I might not. Well, I do usually go for chests that are a bit uh, higher up, because sometimes you can get some good enchantments out of them. Always go for desert temples. See if a desert temple hasn't been looted, you could get some good enchantments. But I got sharpness five out of one once, and sharpness five is pretty decent, especially if you don't have many of your weapons ready yet. Like, see, every time I get to level thirty, I'm just gonna enchant a piece of gear, so I can like get my gear ready. Because the more armor I have, the more ready I'll be for PvP.
There's a dark forest. Cows. It's my, it's my armor full. Yeah, it's full. I want the XP, please. There we go. Let's continue on. Oh, I love the dark forest so much, it's so cool. Wee bit of lag there. TPS is starting to go down. I guess the lag machines are on again. Or is this a lot of people trying to join? Leather. I've got a decent amount of leather now. Some chests, but they're not that, that close to the top of the ground, so I'm not going to go for them. Like, dungeon chests are not really worth it, they're only really worth it if they're like easy to get to, because see the hard to get to ones, like yeah you might get an enchantment, but it's really low chance you'll get an enchantment. I don't even know if the dungeon chests give you the enchantments, I know the desert temples do, but I don't know about the dungeon chests. They should give you enchantments, I'm thinking. But yeah. This is a big dark forest. There we are. Good old parkour, right. Now we're getting into this kind of forest. I don't know what this one's called. I think it's just called Spruce Forest. There's a chest all the way down there. It's a big island. Time we on nineteen minutes. I'll give it. I'll give it an hour. Five minutes. I love this sprint. Like, see for them the hacks. Bloody, see the auto sprint. It is so helpful. Just constantly sprinting. 
It's great. Look at this speed. Jump, jump. Oh, I missed. God damn it. Dag never. Come on, there we go. I'm hoping I get to find a desert soon and we can find a desert temple because I want more enchantments. Like, I could fish them, but that would take ages. No fish in a while on this. I could just auto fish. Now that I think of it, like just let myself auto fish for a bit. I guess I'll do that. No oh, wait, I don't have any inventory space. One minute. Put that in there, that in there. I'll put the sugar cane in there as well. Why not? Uh, get rid of this. This. And this, gonna try out auto fishing. I'm gonna end the video once I get over here. Well, if you liked the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, may Larry's big bulging chin be with you always. I hope you enjoyed.